Hey everyone, Scott here from Simple Mechanic Advice. Today we're going to talk about how to fix a car fuse that keeps blowing. Here is what causes it and how to fix the issue. Faulty fuse replacement. Car fuse types vary based on amperage and material. Therefore, if your car fuse keeps blowing, it is likely that a fuse of lower amperage was used to replace the old one. In such a case, use your car's manual to find the diagram that lists the needed amperage rating for all the fuses and circuits they're placed in. Alternatively, work with an auto expert to locate the right fuses and their exact positions. Always use the correct fuse rating to prevent this. Note that a higher amperage fuse is a safety risk as it may not blow when it should, leading to potential overheating and damage. Faulty alternator. Your car's fuse may be blowing frequently due to a faulty alternator causing sudden power fluctuations and surges. An alternator with an internal short circuit or faulty voltage regulator will result in a blown fuse. The solution here will be to inspect the alternator to rule out output problems. Use a multimeter to test if this is the case with your car's alternator. Here is how you do it. Set your multimeter to DC voltage mode. Next, measure the voltage across the battery terminals with the engine running. Connect the positive, red probe to the positive terminal and the negative black probe to the negative terminal. The reading should be between 13.5 to 14.5 volts. You have a short somewhere. You likely have a wire that is cracked or loose somewhere in your car, and when it comes in contact with anything metal, it grounds itself. In such a case, there will be a surge and a short that is responsible for the fuse that keeps blowing. To fix this, reference your car's wiring diagram and use a multimeter to test for amperage and continuity. The wiring diagram will help you know the location of all the car fuses. Inspect all of them to ensure that none are blown. If you find any that are blown, replace them. A great starting point is on the constantly blowing fuse. Visually inspect for physical damage on all the wires from it. If there are none, use a multimeter to locate the origin of the short. Finding the short is frustrating. An alternative is having a professional find it as they used more advanced tools such as an automotive electrical open and short finder or an electrical circuit tracer. Thanks for watching.